Hey guys, so it's happy Monday. Welcome to the start of a new read and vlog. So let's start off with what I am currently reading. Currently reading two books. Um, I am listening to the audiobook to Harry Potter and the Order of the Phoenix. I am about 357 pages into it. Really enjoying it. So I got quite a lot to go. And then I am reading the Bromance Book Club. I am loving this book. I am 316 pages in, almost done with it, honestly. I got maybe like 20, 30 pages left. So really enjoying that. So I'm probably gonna finish this today. Um, but I have a little bookish meal that I thought I'd share with you and you think I would open this before I actually sat down and started filming this no so this is actually part of my black friday order from the bookish box um there was a mix up with my order so this is actually the rest of it that i ordered so i'm so glad it's here and it's prettier in person let me open it get it out of the package okay so this was in, I forget what box, but it was in one of their boxes. And it's the I Ship It pins. And the bottom one is one of my favorite quotes from Akatar. To the star, to the people who look at the stars and wish. And the top one says, we are fools, we are all fools in love. And I can't remember what the top one's for, but... I really wanted these and people are selling them for crazy amounts of money on the buy and sell site so I just kept checking the bookish website and they finally posted it so I got it so I'm really glad to finally have it it's finally here I'm gonna put it on my board but but anyways so I don't really have much planned today I'm gonna sit and read and um, Becca's coming over later tonight so it should be fun so I think I'm gonna go and I will check in with you guys later. Bye guys. Okay guys, so I just finished the Bromance Book Club and I loved it. It was so, so freaking good and so cute. I love that they're like these group of guys uh, created this book club so they could like help their relationships with like their wives or their girlfriends. And it was about a guy fighting for his wife. And I just think that it's like the sweetest thing ever. Like, oh, I loved it. It was great. Five stars. So good. Oh my gosh, it's so freaking good. So, so yeah, I just want to let you know I finished it. I can't wait for the next one to come out. I can't remember when it's coming out. But I, you definitely can bet I will be pre-ordering that one. Because I, I'm in love. I love this. Love this book. Such a good book. <laughs> But anyways, so now I gotta go and I think I'm going to actually go pick up another romance book over there. <laughs> and I think I might try another one because I've been really enjoying romances lately. So, I'm gonna roll with it. So yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna do. Oh gosh, I'm really tired. I have a little bit more time before Becca comes over. So, I'm excited. But anyways, I am going to go and I will talk to you guys later. Bye guys. Good morning guys. So it's really early in the morning here. I am actually going to be heading up to Bismarck today to get some of my vehicle fixed. And so I have to leave at six. The boys are still sleeping. So I'm just getting everything ready. I'm gonna take my book in my quarter books and family book sleeve. Um, so, I'm going to take that with me. Um, got an overnight bag just in case. Because you never know with, you know, work, mechanical work. It always seems to take forever. So, I am just waiting on my mother-in-law to get here. She's going to watch the kiddos today. Yeah. Oh, I got one that just woke up. So, I'm going to probably go... Bud. and Mommy. I will check in with you guys later. Bye. Mommy. Hey guys, so I just got back from Bismarck probably about, I want to say 20 minutes ago. 
got the kiddos to bed, and I got some book mail. So the first one was my book of the month pick, which I picked Ash Lords by Scotch Brennington. Um, this is about Phoenix horses, which sounds awesome, and I always loved horses, so, and this cover just called to me, so I got that one. I wasn't interested in any of the other picks. So, the next mail I got is pain related. So, this one is from Dustin Pages, and it's Hedwig. This was in their winter box. I didn't get, um... But I love the pin, and then I saw they had the extras on the website, so I got the pin because I love Hedwig. And then I got another package from Laser Brain Patch Company. However, I'm not going to really show you these because they're a gift for a friend. But there is one thing in here that I can show you that I got for myself. And that is... Baby Yoda says, he protects, he naps, he snacks. <laughs> I love it. I love it. So, and then these are the, the gift for a friend, so I'm not going to show you those. You already know what they are because I actually just got them, so. Um, so, that was my mail. Got a little bit of a reading update for you guys. I took the Simple Wild with me and I got to chapter four, page 40, 44. So not too far into it, but it's just getting to a good spot, I guess. So I am really enjoying it though. So we'll see how the rest of the story goes. But yeah, so I took that with me. I got some books when I was at Bark. So, like I was saying before my husband called, I picked up some books from Barnes and Nobles with my gift card. I got three books I'm super excited about. Fix Her Up by Tessa Bailey, uh, Romance, Well Met um, by Jen DeLuca. I hear good things about that one. And then Fight or Flight by Samantha Young. Sounds really good. And then, so that's what I got with my Barnes & Noble gift card. Also, while I was up there, I went to Target and I got three more books. Um, I got this one, Would You Like to Meet by Rachel Winters. Sounds super cute. Um, Husband Material by Emily Belden. And then I got Faker, which I actually really wanted. And this one's by Sarah Smith. So, I got those three books. So, yeah, I brought home six books. And then, also while I was at Target, they had some extra Christmas jammies on sale, on clearance. So, I got a set of those for myself because they were on clearance. Got some stuff for my kiddos. Um, and then I went to Hobby Lobby, and Hobby Lobby is like my favorite store. So I got some really cute little Valentine Llamas decorations. Um, I got some budget planners for my planner. And then some new material for some pin hoops, which I'm super excited about. Not the Peppa Pig ones, just the other ones. Peppa Pig for my kids. What? So, and then, oh, I got some, I got some stickers for my positivity journal. Some cute little llama stickers. I don't know what it is about the cute llamas. I'm like all for the cute llama stuff. Oh, also I was at the Target area. I went into the mall and I went to Hot Topic and I very rarely get to go into Hot Topic. So I went in and I was just looking around. I wasn't going to really get anything but then I saw that they had some cute enamel pins and then I found some stickers and I've been all about stickers lately so the enamel pins were buy two get one free so I got this one it's really pretty Aladdin one I really like this one this one's by Loungefly which that's what my purse is from 
So, um, I got that one, and then I got the mystery machine from Scooby-Doo. I got that one for free. And then Stranger Things Chips Ahoy uh, ice cream parlor badge. And then I got two free stickers. I got a Corgi because I have a Corgi. I have Olaf because I love Olaf. I have another Corgi because that was one of my free ones and I didn't really see any other ones. I got BB-8 and just roll with it, which I love. I got a Stranger Things one. And I got a pa pa ooh, pa how do you say his name? The pig from uh, Moana. I thought he was cute. So, I got him free too. So, yeah, that was my haul today. Uh, I was trying to keep this short. So, um, I think I'm going to go now and get ready for bed because I'm really tired. It's been a long, very cold day. Like, it was negative 17 this morning, and it was, like, single digits all day, and it's been just freezing, and the wind's been so cold. So, yeah, I'm really tired. I'm ready for bed. So, I will probably check in with you guys tomorrow. See you guys. Hi, everyone. Happy Friday. So, I just want to do a check-in. I've been actually doing tax stuff all day. Well, most of the day, I should say. But I decided to take a little bit of a break and give you guys an update. I am listening to the audiobook to Harry Potter and the Order of the Phoenix, and I am not far into it. I, um, I'm on page 247. So I have quite a bit done. I only have like four days left, I want to say, on the audiobook. Oh, you go. You got me okay? Um, so I only have like four days left but I want to try to finish it because it took me forever to get the hold. Um, so, so yeah, so I'm going to try to finish that. I'm going to work on some more tax stuff and I want to try to get a, a bulk, a big bunch of this done. Um, but yeah, that's kind of what's going on my Friday. Um, I don't really have to do a whole lot today because the house is pretty clean. So I just been, messing around on my computer and listening to my audiobook so it's been a good day but I did get a little bookish mail I got another pin I guess it would be pin mail it wouldn't be bookish mail I got another pin and it's another baby Yoda one this one's from castles and confettis and I didn't even know they had this pin um until I was watching their story and somebody else had gotten it and I'm like I gotta go see if that's still available and it was so I got it it's called snow kid and look at his little scarf. It's got like the helm, like the Mandalorian helmet on it. It's so freaking cute. I love it. I'm gonna put it on my Star Wars pin board. So, yeah. Um, and my cat is like laying in my lap while I'm trying to work. But it's okay. Um, so yeah. So that's kind of like what's been going on today. Not very exciting, but I'm getting stuff done. I gotta get stuff done. But anyway, so I think I'm going to go and get back to taxes and get back to listen to my audiobook because I really want to know how it's gonna end. So I will check with you all later. Bye guys. Hello everyone. Happy Monday. So welcome to the start of a new reading vlog. I figured I better open up this vlog and let you know what I'm reading. I am, I am not really in the greatest mood right now. Like, I was fine this morning and I was, I was doing fine. But then, I don't know, like the last hour of my just mood went down. My depression is starting to take hold and it's really crappy and I hate feeling like this. So yeah, that's kind of what I'm struggling with right now. Like, and then I'm just frustrated and frustrated and I just, uh, I don't know. I was doing good this morning, but I'm just, my mood's starting to go. So I'm going to try to do stuff to get out of it. So what I'm currently reading, I'm currently reading The Simple Wild by K.A. Tucker. This is, I believe, like an adult contemporary romance really enjoyed it. I'm not very far into it. I want to say like maybe like four or five chapters. 
I am chapter 4, page 45. So, I'm not very far, but really enjoying it so far. And then I think I'm going to start on audiobook. I actually started reading this one a while ago, but I didn't get very far. Um, I got to <laughs> page 8. Yeah, so um, I think I might start this on audiobook because I actually... I actually got the audiobook from Audible, 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 oh, Audible for Becca because we, she borrows my audiobooks. So I just got the audiobook last week. So I think I'm probably going to start it on audiobook and maybe listen to some of it today while I'm in my office area trying to avoid people. Like, I don't know, my mood. Um... So yeah, I may pick this up, one up and start listening to an audiobook because book club is actually next, or well, this coming Sunday, I guess. So, so yeah, that's what I'm currently reading right now. But I think I'm going to do some editing of some videos because I would like to try to get some videos uploaded. I really should take some pictures, but I'm just... I don't know, I'm just really tired all of a sudden. It's weird. So, and sorry about my mess that is me. I just don't really feel like doing anything with my hair today. It's the best I got. So, I did run out to the store earlier because I needed to get a few groceries. And while I was at Family Dollar, I found this blanket. It's one of those Sherpa uh, fleece. But it's so freaking soft and it's like the buffalo check and I love it it was like five dollars and I kind of splurged and bought it for myself and it's so freaking soft I love it so they have another one there I may I am tempted to maybe go get another one but I do love this I don't know what it is about Sherpa line or fleece stuff I just love it so much it's so soft <laughs> so but anyways so yeah I did splurge a little bit on myself but, oh, mm, I want to try to get my vlog edited and uploaded. Or maybe another video edited and uploaded. I don't know. I have a couple videos that I've been, I've been, I've been really weird with my videos lately. I'm just, I've been trying to, like, film, but everything, like, every time I go to film, like, something comes up. So I haven't had a chance to. So I'm still going to film like, um, you know, the 2000 or 2020 releases. I still do want to do that because I do have a list of them that I'm really excited about. And then I want to do, like, my favorites from last year. Um, so, yeah, I still have some videos that I need to do. Um, kind of like an end of the year wrap up. I think I was going to do one of those. So, yeah. Hopefully one of these days I'll get a chance to actually sit down and film. But, excuse me. My kiddos are out of school today. They don't have uh, school because I think it's, what, Martin, Mar Martin Luther King Day or something like that. I don't know. Some kind of holiday. Um, so, yeah. So, I'm kind of hanging out in my office. The kids are playing. I think I'm going to edit. Um, I think also I want to, so I actually was able, or I actually brought in some of my bookish stuff that I haven't had really of a home for. So I brought in that sign up there. I got it from Bookish Signs and More. It was in the, I can't remember, like Aurora Ryzen box that they did. So I got that and I hung it up there and then I brought in my little Nightmare and Daydreams shelf buddies. I put them up there because my boys keep wanting to play with them and they're trying to ruin them. And they're, yeah. So I put them up there with all my little like Zoom Zoom, Beauty and Beast Zoom Zooms. And then I brought this pin banner out and put all those pins on it. So yeah. So that's kind of what I was doing. Ah, oh, crazy kids. But I also, I was went to Family Dollar to find a frame for this because I think I want to put this in a frame and like hang it up 
over there somewhere or maybe over there on the wall. And then I also wanted to find a frame for this. This is like my big Harry Potter uh, map. The Wizarding World of Harry Potter. I really want to frame this, but apparently my family dollar don't carry picture frames anymore. Surprisingly. So now I have to order them off of Amazon because I'm not going to Walmart anytime soon. So, so yeah. What do you need? Oh, excuse me. What's up, dude? Good. Mm -hmm. What are you doing in front? I'm just vlogging a little bit. Okay. Anyways, so, so yeah, that's kind of what I was doing this morning. So, I think I'm going to... I don't know what I'm going to do. I just, my brain just totally went... It's gone. Anyways, <laughs> um... So yeah, I think that's all I have to really update you guys on right now. So I think I'm probably going to go and sit. Ooh, do some editing. Listen to an audiobook. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. But I'm going to go now and I'll check in with you guys later, I suppose. Bye, guys. Hey, guys. Happy, let's see, what is today? Tuesday. So... As you can tell, I'm actually in my office area and I decided that I'm going to take it over completely and move all the toys out of here and make this like my own personal space. So as you can tell, I already started bringing over my bookshelves, just the ones that were like by the window. So I started to bring those over and I started to organize it a little bit. So I thought I would do like, um, uh, I can't even think of what I was going to say, like do a, a clip there where I'm like organizing my bookshelves and then I'll give you a little bit of a tour at the end. So yeah, so that's what I'm doing today. So let's just get right into this.
Okay guys, so I kind of got it cleaned and organized in here, so I'm going to give you a little bit of a tour of my office. So let's do this. Okay, so coming in the door, there's this bookshelf which just has miscellaneous office stuff on it. My sewing machine and this it is part of the closet, but I don't really use the closet a whole lot much. And this I kind of use as a footstool when I'm working in here, so I just kind of pull that out so I can get into there easy. Don't mind my desk, it's a mess, but that's my desk. And I got some bookish stuff over here. I really like my desk corner. I think it turned out really nice. And then over here underneath the window, I got one of my bookshelves with some books on it and a speaker and some other little things at the top. But And then in the bottom, I have like bookish stuff in those baskets. And then coming over here, I got my printer and then like cookbooks and photo albums. And then I got a lot of paper. I'm working on some paper flowers for my mom's birthday. So I got a lot of paper. I got this bin full of a quarter books and family book sleeve, which I'm not sure where to put. Um, but yeah, and then this bin has stuff I need to take photos of. And then that dresser used to be like, went through my whole family. Um, went through my mom, my brothers, and then me, and then my kids. So it's in here. Don't use it for clothes, but I use it for other stuff. And then next is the two little bookshelves um, with different, just different books on it. I'll give a better detail uh, bookshelf tour later. I do have my two big posters on the wall. My husband has a couple more he wants to put up in here, so that's why it's just on this wall. And then moving on to the corner is, this is like book haul stuff I need to do. And then I have like my Disney books kind of set here because I didn't have room for them. And I could probably get another little bookshelf, but we'll see. And then I got a basket with blankets and pillows. And then we go over here. And these are like my main big shelves. This is kind of where I'm going to film in front of from now on. And I'm actually looking forward to filming in my new space. I'm gonna probably do that here soon. But, but yeah, so that is my office tour. So anyways, that's my office tour. I hope you guys kinda enjoyed seeing what I'm doing like with my office. I'm like having my own space, like, and it'd be nice if I can get away from the boys and actually film and it won't be like so noisy. So I'm really looking forward to that. But, um, but yeah, so this is kind of my own space now and I'm really enjoying it. Mm, excuse me. Um, I may like down the road, I may end up like repainting the walls and stuff, but right now I'm not going to worry about that. So I'm not, I'm not going to worry about it. I'm going to enjoy it the way it is. <laughs> but now over in the corner where my bookshelves were, I'm going to make like, um, take the boys's toy chest out there and kind of make like a little uh reading nook for them out there um since they like to play with their toys out in the living room anyways so it'd be easier to clean up you know since they're all right there and whatnot so so that's my plan but i'm tired so i think i'm going to take a break for a little bit and maybe do some filming while I'm thinking about it and yeah, go from there. So I'm going to go and I will check in with you guys a little later. Bye guys. Hey everyone, happy Thursday. So I have a very busy day. We have, my boys have dentist appointments this morning and then we have chiropractor appointments this afternoon. So I'm gonna be like all over the place today. Um, but and I'm really tired, but I am actually going to um, restart the audiobook to, or restart the book um, to occur so dark and lonely. I'm going to start the audiobook today. I've only like eight pages into this, so I'm just going to restart it over. So I got that downloaded into my phone, and I was looking at, or I started listening to it, and it's actually a full cast audiobook, which I did not know. So I'm actually really excited about that. Um, so, so I'm going to start that today and then, um, uh, and then I got to go take the boys to the dentist and go to Dixon. It's just going to be a long, a very long day. Um, 
but but yeah hopefully I'll be able to like do some fun stuff in between but the boys actually are not going to go to school today only because since we have our dentist appointments this morning and then chiropractor's appointments in the afternoon it's no there's no point in me sending Jackson to school for like maybe like two hours so so I'm just gonna keep him out today but yeah that's pretty much it that's going on so I think I'm going to go and I'm going to get the boys dressed finish my plexus and my Hufflepuff coffee cup which is kind of funny because it's not actually coffee it's plexus and then I'm going to get the boys dressed and get ready to go thankfully my mother-in-law is going to meet me over there for the dentist appointment so that's going to help because all three of them are getting their teeth checked today so <sighs> it's going to be a long day so but anyways that's all I really have for you right now so I think I'm going to go and I will check in with you guys later bye guys hey everyone edited Melissa here so I just wanted to kind of give you guys a reading update because I didn't really talk about the books a whole lot, which surprises me. And I didn't even let you guys know in this vlog that I actually finished Harry Potter and the Half-Blood Prince. Um, I thought maybe I did, but for some reason I'm like missing footage of some of, for some reason I thought I mentioned it, but I looked through and I didn't say anything about it, but I did finish this really enjoyed it. The audiobook's really good. So yeah, I finished that one. And then after that, I actually moved on to the next book in the series. But I also did finish A Curse So Dark and Lonely on audiobook and it was thoroughly enjoyable. Um, it has two narrators, the male character and the female character, which I really enjoy when it does that. Um, so yeah, it was really good. And I love this book. It was so good. So, yeah, those are the two books that I actually finished in this vlog, which you'll hear more of my thoughts in a recent reads video coming soon-ish. But um, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I'm sorry, it is very late and very long. It seems to be typical of me to forget to post every week. So, I'm sorry. But I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Anyways, um, please don't forget to comment down below. Um, I love chatting with you guys. Like and subscribe. And yeah, that's all I have for you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys in my next vlog. Bye.